Hello everyone, it's Benny Bones here, and I am back to play some more Minecraft. It's been a while since I've played Minecraft. Um, and what I have got here is Agarian Skies. Um, a modded Skyblock. I always love the old Skyblock maps, and I love the um, Feed the Beast maps. So this is done by one of the members of Feed the Beast, or some of the people in the Feed the Beast team. And it is uh, a lot of the newer mods which have all been worked into uh, another Skyblock. Um, it's really cool because you get this little quest book here. And if I just go back to my normal view, if you open the little quest book. It has been a horrible are. 10 years. And it even, it even reads it to you, the whole storyline. And released um, hordes of monsters from other dimensions I'll just, uh, on unsuspecting... There we are, I'll just close that. Um, because otherwise it'll just read through it forever. So basically the gist is, uh, the world has been destroyed, you have been saved by the merciful gods. Um, and they've put you here on this little rock. And they say you can rebuild the world. So um, that's, if, that's basically it. Um, we've got this basic uh, basic stuff here, which has been given to us. Oh, look, it's all here. Um, I just grabbed... Oh, I won't need to take all that. I'll throw that. Because it, also, it, it's a sky block. Um, and if we look up here, it actually has lives. If you have a certain number of lives you have. Uh, it monitors how many times you die, and you've got to complete these quests. So you've got quests to complete. So if I open this, these are my quests. What's my first quest? Um, okay, using the book. So basically I need to offer it some oak planks. So let's get some wood on the go, shall we? And the old mouse wheel here works. My mouse wheel's got like a lump in it or something, so it doesn't work very well. Should be annoying. We'll just throw you down and bone mill some crap out of you. Come on. No. Wait. Not playing nice, this one. There we are. Get me some loggies. Okay, that should do. So now if I create them and look at my book, it should have updated my quest for me. Ah, there we are. Create, craft a, a wooden plank. And that's what I did. And now the rewards will give me a pickaxe, a splintered dreams, and an apple. Ah, oh, that music, it's so nice. Do 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 Something like that. Um I can pick a library, so you've got to make the book binder. And this one here, which is you gotta manually submit some wood to it. And it'll give you the quest delivery system. See I've 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 really addicted to this game at the moment, so um, I'll just blast through these first little bits here, because if you want to learn to play, you can always do it in your own, um, you, can, you should pick it up and give it a try for yourself. Um, and now, if the good thing about these uh, quest delivery systems is you can actually um, tell it to learn stuff. So if I go select task, right click on there, it now knows that I want to give it a piece of wood. And if I look to my book, it's come up saying there. And now I've got a hand back in the hopper. So it doesn't want to give you the hopper. Pop. Um, manually submit the hopper. And we get a heart out of it. And a reward bag. This is the hearts here. Um, consumed to get one extra life. So I'll do that. And these uh, goodie bags, these reward bags, which are really quite nice sometimes. So if I use this bag, it, it, what's it giving me? Uh, berry juice and cherry juice. Oh, not too bad. Uh, I'll break that and throw them in the box. But food is an issue in this map. Um, if you don't have food, you as soon as your hunger runs out, you instantly die. So it's something you keep in mind. So I'm just going to smash some trees, you know, punch wood, get trees. Punch trees, get wood, that's it. So th let's see if any more quests have unlocked. Now I've done the basics. Um, what's this? Build the basic stuff here. Crook, oak barrels, stencil tables, all that kind of fun stuff. And all these quests here will unlock when they're available. Um, we'll have a look at these ones here. These ones here are a pain in the butt. Like with this one here, you got to get 100,000 oak logs, which is a pain in the butt. Um, 
this black thing here is eight times compressed cobblestone. So it's eight times eight times eight times eight. Oh no, nine times nine times nine times nine times nine times nine times nine cobblestone. It is insane. Oh, did I get a yeah, yeah sapling? So those kinds of things you want to get onto pretty pronto because um, otherwise you just run out of. It'll just take you forever. Through this here. No, I won't put that there. I'll um, use the Tinker's Construct table because uh, then my stuff won't fall out of it when I walk away. So, yeah. so now I can leave my wood on there and it won't fall off. Ha ha! Ooh, saplings. Saplings are like gold on this map. <laughs> um, so what did I want to make? I needed to make some of these things. Some templates. So one of them was an oak thing like that. It's the part builder. Bidding, I got a book for that. Uh, one of them is like this. Stencil table. Um, then I think there's a crafting bench you got to do one with. Uh, I need more wood. Anyway, you're going to make a crook as well. There's a crook. These things are handy because you smash the leaves and you get a higher chance to get saplings and um, the rest you get out of it. Silkworms, which you'll need. It's really quite clever how everything just works together at the beginning here. Okay, time to bone meal some more trees. Oh, that was quick. You always use the crook on these things if you can. Apart from them breaking really easy. And hold shift. Shift is your friend. Ah, uh, the old skyblock. Skyblock tactics. The beginning of this game is very grindy, so... It's fun, but it's very grindy. Um, I want to get an axe at some point, so that'd be good to get one. But you can't make an axe out of wood, I don't think. So, some things have been taken out. Um, yeah, what have we got here? We've got some more wood now. So what else do I need to do? Uh, some more like this. On top of that. Um, I have to check my book now, I can't remember. There was, uh, there was a barrel, wasn't there? Wrong book. Uh, learning the sky block. That one. Oh yeah, I've got to make a chest and a barrel. Yeah, and I need more wood to make a barrel. You worked. An apple! And with this, it's called a mod called Hunger Overhaul. And um, what it does is it makes, uh, it, it reduces the amount of nutri uh, nutrition you get out of food. So if I wanted to eat those apples, they'll only give me half a hunger each, which is, um, Pretty lame. So it just means you've got to either eat a lot of food, a low level food, or the higher level stuff you make, the higher food you get, the more, um, gotta make a, a plat a thing on the base, the higher, the more, uh, what am I saying? And a barrel. Um, the higher, the harder it is to make the food, so the more effort goes into making it, the more nutritious it is. So um, that's something you gotta keep in mind. So all the basic, like, Apples and things like that you find at the beginning. They don't give you a lot of nu nutrition. So you've got to make, make apple apple pie or something and that will give you more than just having an apple. Yeah. Uh, get that last of that wood. And we'll hand this quest in, which gives me food. Ow. <coughs> no, yeah. I'm just untangling myself. Alright, yeah, and where's my book? Okay, claim rewards. We get the choice of an axe of despair or a pan 
of destiny. Um, I honestly am going to go with the pan. So it lets you cook food at the beginning. Oh, but then I've, you know, I've got those juices. Those juices should be all right. Um, I, I, I usually always go with the pan. Well, last time I went with the pan, I should say. Um, it's only a wooden axe, so, so. Yeah, we'll go with the frying pan. And I have a quarter of a heart. I'll save that. And with that book, what are these books here? World domination with open blocks. Basic materials and processing. Mariculture. And we've got another questing book. Ooh, and eight flint. So I can make myself something. Ooh, only these. I should get my um, tool station on the go. Stencil table. Uh, I'll pop out a foot next. And tool station. Ah, uh -huh. now I can make myself my own axe. Why didn't I think of that before? Because I'm a doofus. And stencils. So what we want is, what's that? Tool rod, we'll need a tool rod. And we need an axe head. Axe head pattern, there we are. Tool rod, we'll use a stick. Parts can be replaced. I don't know how, how you, I don't know, know how you replace parts, it's the thing. And with this, I am, what I have got here is some flint, so I'm going to use a bit of flint. Bidding. And we go to the axe, and we go flint, and a tool rod. And that gives me an a, a clumsy, uh, I'm with, as you can see, it's got XP on it there. So the more you use an item, the, the, the more it levels up. So an item will actually level with you. Um, then this is how I normally have everything set up. I like my pickaxe on two, my axe on three, shovel, wrench, and other, uh, torches go here and my sword at the beginning, which at the moment is my fry pan. Let's see what I got in my reward bag. So yeah, the more you use an item, the, the more uh, it it gets abilities like it'll get auto repair or it might get redstone, you know, hasted and things like that. So it makes it makes it worth a while having a tool for a while. A fishing rod. Um, mine factory reloaded. Is that the TNT fishing rod? I think it is. So I'll put you away. <laughs> um, I'll put my chest down as well because I might need that. Or should I make a pattern chest? Which might be worth it, maybe. Um, I don't know, I'll just throw my chest down and deal with it later. Poop. And there we are. And let's get the old bone meal going again. Oh, there we are. After a while you get all this order. Well, I say after a while. After a long while you can get all this automated. At the beginning it's a long grind. So I might come back after I bone meal some more trees. And get some more saplings. Okay, there we go. I've, uh... Just uh, all, all my trees grew up, and I'm still. I was just hacking through them all. There's still a couple of these left. Um, yes, yeah, so you kind of want to get as many saplings as you can, um, because you can use saplings in these barrels. If I, I'll throw this one down here. So if I can, I can throw my saplings in here. It takes eight saplings, and then it will compost down into dirt. So it's a way of making dirt out of nothing, basically. Or you got tra saplings, which is something. And then you throw them in there. And that will take its time. It slowly goes brown and it becomes dirt. Um, so it takes a little while, but um, we'll just see. So it's, it's losing its green very slowly, <laughs> very slowly. 
Uh, we've got infinite water as well, so that's very handy. <coughs> uh, very slowly. Uh, oh, my hunger's going down as well, so I've got to best keep an eye on that. I want to see the dirt. And there we are. You see the little grey bits pop into it, and that means you can pick it up. It becomes dirt then. Oh, another apple. So I've got two silkworms. Um, you only need one really to get started on your string production. The string is kind of very important to start with, but it means you can start making your sifter and things like that, which let you, lets you get stone and all that fun stuff. Oops, I didn't want to make barricades. Um, need some more of these. Oops, doing a terrible job here. Yeah, two of those. Um, so what do I want? I want to make some half slabs, some more half lad slabs. Because you can put these down, and then it will stop monsters from spawning, of course. Uh, like that. And uh, we can go one lower there as well. I like to try and make it as... Oops, I don't want it there. I mean, the monster will spawn. Don't want mobs. Don't want bad mobs. <laughs> there we are. Some more blocks down. So I'll get rid of this rest of this tree. There's me saplings. Yeah, let's see how let's see how, how well this food does for me. I've got 14 apples. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to heal up. That's something you gotta keep on in this game is your hunger. Dude. Like I mentioned, if your hunger drops to zero, no matter how much health you've got, you'll instantly die. It's an insta kill. So you have to pay attention to your food quite constantly. Um, let's put this little tree over here. Bit of dirt. And a sapling. And we'll bone meal him up. Any time, Mr. Tree. There we are. And we throw this little wormy in there. Go, my little friend. So now he will do his business. And all the leaves will turn white. And when that happens, I'll be able to get the string from it. Let's just convert all that into wood and let's make some more planks from some flooring for myself. 30. Ooh, another dirt. They can go in. Oops, no more room in there. How about in this one? There we are. Ah. Uh, I really just don't want to fall off, that's kind of a good reason to do all this, but um, as you can see there's nothing down there, well, that's, I don't know what that tiny little block is down there, maybe that's bedrock or something, something way down there, a little tiny dot. I've never really gotten that low to find out. Um, you can get fly potions get them as rewards, um, potions of flight. So that gives you what, 18 minutes to fly around and check it all out. See, so yeah, as we can see there, the tree is uh, slowly changing color. Some of these leaves underneath are starting to go white and they're all slow slowly changing. That's a good sign. Chop um, the rest of these down now. How much XP does my axe have? Uh, 28 out of 105 or whatever it was. So it won't level up straight away. It takes a little bit of use. But the better they get, the more you use them. So I always like that about them. 10. Poop. Poop. Give me another barrel. I should be making more barrels because they collect the rain when it rains. Um, 
You kind of want rain. And three barrels. They, they, it says in the book, it says you should really put down three barrels outside and three barrels inside. To, um, but because I don't have an inside, I haven't got a house yet, um, the best I will do is like this. And then put a half slab on top. Well, that'll stop the rain from getting in that barrel. Not the best, but hey, and it's a half slab so they won't spawn on top. See, there we are, my tree's turning white. Um, but I think this is good enough for my first episode. Uh, I want to keep playing this, it's a fun little game. Um, I'll eventually do a multiplayer with Eddie as well, my brother Hydro. I'll do a multiplayer with Hydro. And um, from there we will do a multiplayer. Because you can do it all, the little quest book all links up so you can do multiple people all together. Um, see string, that's what we've got. Use silkworms on leaves uh, and then crook to harvest the white leaves. You're getting string to make the recipes. Then click on the new task that shows up on the left to proceed to the quest. So it says this one here, you got to get string and then it progresses out this way. Alright. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, um, I know what button I'm pressing. Yeah, I'm Benny Bones. This is uh, Minecraft in uh, Agarian Skies. Um, until next time, adios.